unkempt. It's them stairs. She has me up there five times a night, changing the torches. Oh, indeed. I shall inform my lady of your displeasure. Don't, Don't you, you dare. dare. Love his dialogue. <laughs> hey, lady. You're gonna get knocked out in a minute. Don't worry about it. I like to knock this guy out or else he goes wandering up the stairs for ages. Thought I heard something. Yeah, you did, buddy. I love when they slide down. I've turned off the physics improvements of the mod because they actually cause some problems. I think that's what was causing problems when I had uh, an issue where if I jumped wrong, I would float way more often than it happens in the actual game. It will happen. It's guarantee. But it happened more with that mod on, so I turned it off. Now, I know there's... Get out of my way, rat. Oh, shit. Wake up there, imbecile. Oh, God. Yes, your lordship. Oh, my shit. Word. Well, I guess that's my first fuck-up, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's alright. It's no big deal in this mission. Um... I, I usually do this. Oh god. Someone there? Why do I keep Clear forgetting? Yourself. God damn it. Right, I need to hide my bodies better. Sorry about that. Okay, let's just put this body in here. Is that a good idea? No. Um, I'll put him back here. Yeah, Garrett has a really big thing about saying, ah, uh, it's quite lovely actually. Now this is one of the places where it punishes you for um, standing in the thing, so you have to be very careful or put out that torch, which I don't really do in this mission. Not many places to do it. Uh, Lord Ember should be in here somewhere, so I'm kind of scared that he'll come and see me. Now why would you put a torch there? I wonder. Another medallion. Wonder if anyone will pay more for a match to set. Yeah, that's the that's the key. There's two medallions. That's how you get into the uh, vault. Now, um, this torch turns uh, opens the portcullis that we I think we heard in one of the notes that was installed. But yeah, um, yeah, this is a pretty boring one. He's crazy and he's an asshole. So uh, that's page two, and that's it. Um, and yeah, there's a bunch of shit to loot in this. Uh, I think this... No, it's a different one where there's something on top of the bed. Uh, but that isn't here. Uh, now, anyway, um... Yeah, that switch opened a, uh... Porculus to where we need to be. So yeah, we're nearly done with this mission, honestly. We just got one more area to do, and then we can go get the loot and leave. Um, yeah, and we can jump out here. Some free loot. I think... He's still going. Nothing else to do. I'm done up here, so I'm gonna jump down the uh, stylish way. Ah! Oh, no, that that ain't the stylish way. Yeah, let's uh, let's try that again, shall we? Um, yeah, I did not think that would work once I was falling, but oh well. Okay, now there is another area below the area we were just in. Oh god, I picked the worst place to enter. Let's go over here. Oh, and there should be a guy out here. I'm just going to knock him out. For safety. Hey, buddy. Never really happens much. Once in a hundred nights, maybe. <laughs> oh. the, uh, the hitting's a bit weird. You can hit people from very far away, but... It's like uh, in Dark Souls where it queues up the backstabs. It's kind of like that, which is all good. Okay. Jenny was up all night sewing the new uniforms for Lord Ember. Hands all bloody this morning. And Julian will change them right back when he returns, you mark me. You think he'll come back? I never said that. I never said it either. No, th this is a trick here. I'm going to show you a little trick. <clears throat> I learned that. They're perfectly cued, so you can do that. Oh god, I should throw these bodies in the darkness quickly. There we go. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, and that's a little trick you can do. Okay, now this is the cook's quarters, the guy who uh, let me in, basically. The guy who gave me my idea to go on the uh, fucking food truck or whatever. Ah, uh, yeah, cook's journal. Boring, boring. Yep. Okay. Now there's nothing on his. Oh, God! Wow, that was close, wasn't it? Oh, well. What are you doing? Just playing with some grain? Good boy. Oh, did I open this? Oh, I nearly missed it, didn't I? That was very clumsy. That was probably wasted because I probably already have five. No, I don't. Good. Alright, uh, yep. And that's pretty much it for here because all this is junk, I believe. Later in the game, there's some shit in front. Oh, no, there we go. Yeah, later in the game, there's some junk that you can get from there. But, yeah. Uh, and yeah, that is it. Let's go and explore the rest of this area. I'm gonna go through here. Ah, yeah, this is a good room. Some loot in here. Above the fire, and also... Yeah, in fact, while no one's in the room, just put that out. Makes things much easier. Okay, where's the loot? It's that, and it's the thing at the end. Oh yeah, there you go. We've we've reached our loot cap, I think. And I think that's it, basically. I mean, most of the loot is in the thing we're opening, so. I mean, even if there's no real point because we've explored everything and we've got all the new loot we need, uh, so we should be good. Oh, we do need to go to one more place, actually. And that's up those stairs that I didn't go up. Silly me. Um, we'll use this lift that I never used. Let's uh, give it a save, too. Right, let's go in here. Uh, I love the body physics in this game. Although it can be a bit of a problem. If you drop someone on their sword, sometimes it'll kill them. Which is uh, always interesting. Now, I forgot to go up here. This is Lazy El Lady Elizabeth's quarters. And she has some lovely stuff. That'll probably bring us up to near the loot cap. Like, the full 100%. I think I got most of the loot. I, I just, yeah, I didn't bother with some of it. Yeah, and there's stuff on top of her bed. This is where I was talking about. Okay, she has poison. Poisons. Better make sure I wash my hands when I get out of here. Yeah, good on you, Garrett. You wash your hands. Uh, yeah, all this bullshit. That's about her. That's her mother. And yeah, lots of lots of lots of lots of reading in here. So yeah. Now, let's hop on top of the bed, shall we? It's a bit of a bitch, to be honest. I don't know why they put loot there. It's one of the most clumsy bits of loot I've seen. Oh, okay. Now, this is a big piece of loot. One of the special loots, in fact. Gilded Helm. And I think we got everything. Right, let's go get those uh, opals and some diamonds, I believe and we'll be gone. And this has been the first mission. Um, yeah, it's just, I, I don't know if I'll finish the entire game straight up, but uh, I'm definitely gonna try. And it should all go well, as long as I don't have recording issues, which I usually don't. So we should be good. Now, uh, oh, I can just go back through here. All right, now let's head up to this uh, Bloodline Opal. Well, it's down, it's in the basement, basically like a little area that looks like a basement. I think I explored every room, actually. Might have missed one or two, but it's no big deal. Uh, now I believe it is this way. Uh, this is the wrong way to approach from. I'll come from here. Okay, let's do some sneaky sneaking. Let's uh, let's save too. So. Hey guy, you're gonna stop right at the edge of that carpet, aren't you? 
Oh, he went mm. further than he usually I saw... does. That's interesting. Night like this, and it makes you think you see things. Yeah, fat, fat guy. Just hey, what? All right, who's there? Okay, that was a bug. I have no idea what that was. Ah, yeah, that light doesn't count. The lighting system is quite good in this game. Some bugs, but nothing serious. And I think the mods I have make the game a bit harder. They make the enemies detect you easier. And I'm in a blind spot, so I'm going to knock him out. <coughs> oh my fucking huh. god, that ter that's Did Lord Ember. Move? That is Lord Ember. What the fuck is he doing in there? He must have got startled. Huh. I've never seen that before. That is The Rutherford family vault. Weird. That opal is as good as mine. Oh, hello, hello. Key? Wait, what's the key for? I have no idea what that key's for. Anyway. Alright, we so got 95%. What they all wanted. So we could have played it on half. Well, it's better off with me. Yeah, it's better off with Garrett. Everything's better off with Garrett. Garrett is the master of thievery. Let's uh, let's avoid that guy this time, shall we? I think if you time it with sneezes, they might not see you. I'm not sure if that is a feature. I haven't really investigated that. Now, uh, I'd rather not go out through there. I'm going to go out through here. Yeah, I think, I, I think I've explored everything, so that's that. I know the later mission's a bit better than this one, to be honest. But I saw... You saw nothing. Boom. Alright, we win. Now the uh, exit dialogue and then we'll stop this. The bloodline opal's mine now, and based on the size of this thing, I'd say it was worth it. But something tells me this Lady Elizabeth character had her own plans for the Rutherfords. I'd better get the opal to Perry soon. He can cut it into smaller stones that are easier to move. And we'll both make a tidy profit. Okay, yeah, stats. We got pretty much everything in that mission. Pretty good. Okay, 